Faculty of Law, Economics and Finance is the only faculty at the university to have sought and obtained independent accreditation for its master programs from the organization Foundation for International Business Administration Accreditation. This external quality assurance ensures that students are provided with a high quality learning experience in accordance with the Luxembourg Qualifications Framework and the Qualifications Framework in the European Higher Education area. Accreditation, initially obtained in 2015, is valid for a period of five years, and so the 2020-2021 academic year brings with it the need to renew the process for a number of programs as well as to submit our two new masters for accreditation, the Master of Science in Finance and Economics and the Master of Science in Quantitative Economics and Finance. The force behind the accreditation and reaccreditation process is Professor Anke Musig, Professor of Accounting and Audit and a member of the University Council and a member of the University's Board of Governors. Anke has led the team of study program directors and administrators putting in many hours of coordination, drafting, review, in order to prepare our application as well as the remote site visit. This is why our faculty has chosen to nominate her this year for the Teaching Award. Her steadfast commitment to quality and excellence for our students. On behalf of all of our faculty, thank you, Anke. Damian Negre is a PhD student in our doctoral school in law. He has been working closely with Professor Ellis Poayo, actively supporting the university's consumer law clinic. Last year, Damian was instrumental in bringing the Clinicité project to life. This project promotes the field of legal research by connecting master students and high school students. The master students prepare presentations for the high school students informing them of their rights as consumers on shopping apps and online platforms and promoting legal research. Damian guided a group of fourth and fifth year students, encouraging them to apply the principles of the legal clinic. Clear explanations using layman's terms and taking a pedagogical approach. His enthusiasm for the project spread to the students who took the project seriously and fully assured their role as legal researchers and educators for the high school students. Damian also aided in continuing legal clinic activities post-COVID. Coordinating the clinic's newsletter, Damian and the team of students helped us informed of our consumer rights, especially regarding travel cancellations in three special issues. Our faculty nominated Damian for the Teaching Award in the Junior Colleague category because of the positive energy that he brings to the classroom and the way he motivates students and encourages them to develop their critical thinking skills, something which is very important for these future lawyers. He has been a pivotal part in not only maintaining but also advancing the legal clinic, especially during this difficult time. We are proud and fortunate to count Damian among our colleagues. Bravo! He deserves the teaching award because he makes sure that the subject matter has been well understood by his students. And secondly, he is approachable, thus we do not hesitate to ask him questions. And if we do, he will make sure that our questions have been well answered. And if necessary, he will send us additional um, um, course materials. Lastly, um, his whole lecture are enjoyable and you get out of class with the thing that you've truly learned something.